Betsy Kling, did you uh, did you have that hotel room on reserve for you down there for those two dates so you could go back? Oh, they're booked. Oh, darn. Now the big question is not only can NASA launch the rocket, which they have to get permission from the U.S. Space Force, but I have to be asking permission. Yes, I'll probably be on my knees begging. Can we go back down to cover that launch if it's going to happen indeed? Certainly exciting stuff uh, going on there. And over the next few hours, some beautiful weather setting up right here. Temperatures fading back into the upper 50s with clear skies to continue for the overnight. So another night you probably don't need the air conditioning. Nice fan uh, weather for us. We have seen the shadows of the cumulus clouds that popped up through the day today. But those clouds were kind of few and far between this evening. We're going to continue to clear out for the night tonight. And then we keep an eye out to the west. This is an advanced cold front that will bring us rain chances eventually by the time we get into Sunday, which means we have two days here with some uh, beautiful weather still to come. Here's your national designer hour by hour forecast. Those light northerly breezes will go calm tonight. That will allow the temperatures to drop back into the 50s for most of us as we start the day tomorrow. By midday, we'll be up around the 80 degree mark with light southerly breezes. You may see a few cumulus clouds popping up, but I think for the most part, mostly sunny skies will be the rule. Friday night football forecast looks fantastic. Temperatures still in the upper 70s to right around 80. Most sunny skies will continue for us. We'll see clouds on the increase then late Friday night into early Saturday morning. So Saturday we start partly cloudy temps in the 60s. Note it'll be a little bit warmer. By the time we hit midday Saturday, we're into the mid 70s with mostly cloudy conditions. We'll continue to see the clouds coming in and thickening through Saturday night and ultimately those rain chances start to sneak back in here by Sunday. As of right now, it does not look like a washout in your Union Home Mortgage forecast. It looks more or less like we have scattered rain that will be around for Sunday. The better chances for rain will be coming in on on Monday and then even lingering into the day on Tuesday. Then we start to see things backing out again. We'll get into a drier pattern by the middle to end of next week with temperatures in the mid and upper 70s. So much more fall feeling once we get through the weekend. Yeah, some 50s there. How about that? Yeah. All right, Betsy, thanks.